Hi, writing class. I hope we're all doing well. Welcome back to another lesson. For today's class, we're going to be looking at lesson 49, part A, and I've also attached an extra practice sheet to just go over adding in our missing capitals, missing commas, and missing quotation marks. So for today's lesson, it tells us that the writer forgot to punctuate some sentences that tell the exact words that somebody said. So don't forget that exact words need to be within quotation marks. So we need a quotation mark at the beginning of what the person said, and we need a quotation mark at the end of what the person said. The passages also have some run-on sentences. The writer forgot to use a comma when the word but was used to combine two sentences. So remember, when we use the word but to combine two sentences, we need to add a comma before the word. The writer also forgot to put commas in some sentences that name three or more things or actions, or in sentences that begin with a part that tells when, or a part that tells where, or if the sentence began with the words if, although, or unless. So don't forget, if a sentence begins with a part that tells when or where, or if it begins with the word if, although, or unless, we need to make sure to add a comma in that sentence. So for today's work, in lesson 49 part A and in the extra practice sheet, your job will be to put in any missing punctuation. So missing capitals, missing commas, missing capital letters. So please make sure to read it carefully, read the sentence over, read the sentences over. And if you have any questions, please let me know. And also please look over your homework from the last few days and make any corrections you might have. Keep up the awesome work and I'll see you in our next class.